So what's happening guys? Hope your day is going well. If you're new to the channel, my name is Dave. This is my mission to muscle and I go over supplements. I review them. I go over the ingredient profiles just so you guys know what the hell you're putting in your body and the effects on these certain supplements. And today is more of like a mission to fat loss because you know what? Everything Everything that I'm trying to accomplish in life, that I try to accomplish in life, I consider a mission. So whether it's a mission to muscle, a mission to fat loss, a mission to health, everything's a mission with a goal and a focus set on that goal. And that's that mission. So enough said with that. We're going to jump right into this. We're going to review Apollo Nutrition's version 4 Chaos Hardcore Fat Burner. So putting the ingredient profile right off to my left, we'll jump right into this. This has four capsules, as you can see, 30 servings. I like the idea that they did four capsules on this because nothing bugs me more than when I get an odd number in a product of capsules, especially like a stem product or any product that, that's out there because if I want to take half of it, you can't. <laughs> you can't figure half dose off of five pills unless you break a pill up. Who wants to do that? Especially if it's powder. You know what else is in there. You don't have to give you half of it. So the idea of it being an even number, I like the idea I can take two capsules and if it says 300 milligrams of caffeine, I know I'm getting 150 milligrams of caffeine. If it's got 50 milligrams of GBB and I only want 25, then I know I take two capsules. It's just so easy to figure out. I just So I like that aspect on this here. Then we got right on the top here, we're getting into the ingredients, the nitty gritty here. We got Mitoburn, which is Elbeba at 500 milligrams. This is a protein derived from the from the amino acid L-valine. And basically what this does is this initiates the conversion of white adipose tissue to brown adipose tissue, just like paradoxian. So paradoxian has been studied to do that as well. And when this happens, when brown adipose tissue is, and why, when, when brown adipose tissue is becoming more readily available, able to be broken down, as it's being broken down, it increases the thermogenic response in the body by, and also, increases energy because those fats are being flown thrown <laughs> into the um, into the bloodstream and also you have some conversions going on as far as you know got adrenaline responses and stuff because the body sees all these things happening and it recognizes these things in the symp uh, sympathetic nervous system and the central nervous system and you get a little bit of energy kicks because not only are you using this fat for energy but the body's kind of responding to the actions that are being that are happening in the body at the time from the ingredient as far as the fat being into the system there this has also been shown to increase insulin sensitivity so it might have burned it's multiple studies on it it's a very good ingredient so if you see that ingredient in a fat burner don't shake your head at it this is it's a good ingredient then we have a uh, tear axicum dandelion extract at 500 milligrams this dandelion extract is a great source of potassium from one thing which is good because it's used as a diuretic so this this is a fabulous diuretic that's going to help you remove water mainly on the skin layers which is nice so if you're trying to you know cut up look more defined then dandelion extract is a great ingredient to have and a product you know designed to do something like that as far as lose weight and stuff so I like it. Then we got caffeine and hydrus at 300 milligrams. Adenosine blocker blocks the adenosine receptors. Blocks adenosine, awakens you up. Also, when it does that, it has responses with serotonin, dopamine, nor noradrenaline in the brain. So feel good. And also calcium release of the muscles. So in the gym, it's going to give you better contractions. And outside of the gym, caffeine is just going to make you more mobile and more active. So good ingredient. Then we got Inno Slim at 250 milligrams. So this is an ingredient that um, is from Pan Pan Panix Ginseng, I believe. And the main ingredient in here that they're going for as far as the active ingredient is ginsenosides. So it's from ginseng, basically. Ginsenosides. It's kind of fun how they name these things. Um, I think they just make them up. <laughs> they did. Well, they had to, right? They had to make it up. But I mean, it's it's nice because I can remember it easy that way. It's like moccasides and phenocides from fenugreek. So yeah, same thing. So those the ginsenosides gen actually activate, uh, increase GLUT4 activation, which is going to help with glucose, it, enhancing glucose uptake into the muscles and into the cells. So that's a plus. This also has this also blocks a, an ex, expression gene that is within the intestinal tract. And what that does is when that's blocked or reduced, so it doesn't block it completely when it's reduced, and it's like SGLT1 or something like that. There's a few of them out there, T2, but I think it's the one that this gene, when you block it, it inhibits glucose 
uh, uptake into the intestines. So it's going to help you. I, honestly, I don't know what that does. <laughs> it's going to help you, you know, not digest fat, may, not digest the carbs, maybe crap them out. So I don't know what the purpose of that is. I really don't. I don't think about that. It's like on Instagram the other day. I had some guy ask a fabulous question. He goes, I hope this isn't a stupid question. And I looked at it. I'm like, man, that's an awesome question. <laughs> Uh, and he asked me, why do I respond the way I do to Alfie Yo with the chills and all that stuff? thought it was so cool. I was like, that's the first time anybody's ever asked me that. thought it was an awesome question. But I'm going to have to figure it out. I'm going to have to research this some more. And if I do, I'll put it down in the description as far as uh, what the purpose is to, to inhibit glucose uptake into the intestines. So if somebody knows, leave a comment down below. It'd be great. This is all about community here. This is all our missions. We all have the same mission. Uh, whether it's muscle, fat loss, or health. Um, so, yeah, all the help we all can give each other is what we need. So this is uh, it's community, like I said. So let's stay tight. So jumping right back into this, we got uh, Paradoxian, 225 milligrams. Explain that's kind of like Mitoburn. This is, helps with the initiation of the conversion of white adipose tissue into uh, brown adipose tissue. And this is going to convert... The energy storing fat tissue into fat tissue that helps increase thermogenesis and calorie expenditure. There you go. So very simply put, it's a fabulous ingredient. Um, there's no, I, I don't think there's any studies on insulin sensitivity on this particular ingredient. But to have two ingredients that are actually initiating, initiating the conversion of white adipose tissue and brown adipose tissue in a supplement, that's... That these are two ingredients you want in a fat burner. Then we got coca butyrol at 200 milligrams. So coca butyrol is not just a cocoa extract. So this this initiates a, an agonist response to the beta two uh, receptors, which is going to initiate the fat cells to release fat into the stream, and is going to give some kind of C amp expression which is going to cause some kind of fight or flight response. Little because it's not a stem product. And the fight or flight response responds off of the sympathetic nervous system, not the central nervous system. So the sympathetic, sympathetic nervous system is going to be uh, not stemmed, but you're going to have a lot of actions. So you're going to have energy, uh, which is going to be underlying energy, nor, nor epinephrine, dopamine, stuff like that. So you're going to have the cognitive function focus. And this is actually of four different ingredients. So this contains... EGCG, which is made from green tea. It contains theobromine. It contains two dopamines. Uh, Cumoral dopamine. Wait, I'm doing Cumoral dopamine. And caffeol dopamine. You guys aren't going to use that stuff. But having these ingredients, all cocubuterol is a fantastic uh, recomping ingredient because it helps with uh, fat loss. It helps with muscle sparing and muscle gains, muscle protein synthesis. So a great ingredient. It's one of my favorite ingredients. I've always said it on this channel, and and I know what I'm talking about. So anyways, jumping right back into this, we got uh, Capsi Max. Now, Capsi Max is a, uh, it's from red chili peppers, and the active ingredients are Caps, Capsi, Caps, Capsi Sinoids, Capsi Sinoids. <laughs> And there's multiple studies on this increasing the metabolic rate for hours, uh, mobilizing fat, enhancing uh, the resting energy expenditure, and uh, a not a reduction in appetite, but a controlled reduction in appetite. So I don't know if it, appetite control. So it's not that it reduces your appetite a lot, but it allows you to have better control over your hunger. So you can actually eat something or not eat something, that type of a thing. Like if you want to go for it, if you don't, then, you know, then don't. So it helps you control that a little better. I don't know the aspects and the, the modalities of it, but uh, red chili peppers have been around for a long time. This is just that uh, capsaicinoids. Uh, they've been around for a while. I took it a long, long time ago when I was really getting into health for blood flow. And it really helped with blood flow in the lower extremities. And this was just the, uh, the, uh, cayenne pepper form of it so last ingredient on the list our favorite ingredient the um the sweat amplifier here super carnitine gbb what is gbb this is 50 milligrams so gbb is a precursor of carnitine 
So what it does is when you take GBB, it goes in your body, and our body has makes carnitine from GBB already. So when you take GBB, it increases the level of GBB, which activates, activates an enzyme GBD, which breaks down the GBB into carnitine. And the body tries to balance, always, always tries to keep levels. So as you increase GBB, it's going gonna, it's gonna to come down. And you, and you're, if you're going above your own GBB and carnitine level, it's going to come up here. And then you're going you're gonna to teeter and totter a little bit higher on the carnitine to GBB scale. So great ingredient. And this is going to increase energy expenditure. It's supposed to increase fat loss. What this does is it creates a super kick ass thermogenic response this is the main ingredient in this product that makes you sweat it is the sweat amplifier it's crazy so hey how did chaos hardcore fat burner by Apollo nutrition do so i took four capsules for four days straight and i'm glad i'm doing this review now because i don't want to do four capsules again not because it's horrible or i hate it but today i didn't have work so I took it and I was thinking I was going to go off to work afterwards. So it made it makes it a lot easier if you take this at four capsules and you go off and you keep moving. So today I had to sit around. So I sit around I sat around cold and sweaty <laughs> for a couple hours after my training. So you take this from my experience on it most 50 gram, 50 milligrams of GBB where it's this or whether it's uh another supplement of GBB, a quality supplement, because this is quality. Um, you're going to sweat for between three and four hours, but it's going to taper down. The major sweat is going to come within that two-hour mark. I'd say about 45 minutes to an hour after you take it. So um, this product, when you first take the four caps, if you're going to do four caps, it's going to come in and start to work. You start feeling something about 30 minutes, but you really don't feel like a kick of energy, the caffeine coming in, any other energy responses coming from these ingredients and this massively stacked profile until 50 to 60 minutes. But I'd be in the gym 45 minutes after taking it because what happens, what I noticed is if I sat longer than an hour, I got a stim, I got the caffeine effect, I got a little bit of underlying energy. But once you start to move, so I go in the gym and on a treadmill to warm up for five minutes, once I started moving, the energy increased because this thing just all promoted a thermogenic effect right within that 50 minute to an hour mark, increasing the feel of energy the the breaking down of those fats and, and and anything else on top of the caffeine so it has a nice little kick to it as you start moving and it has a nice get up and go feeling so when it does start kicking in and that like 45 minute mark you feel good enough to get up and move so you have a kind of a underlying motivation response and i believe that's from the cocobuterol that's kicking in along with the caffeine but there is a positive type mood to it it's not crazy there's no stim junkie feeling to it but you do have like an uplifted positive mood to go and get shit done not a crazy nootropic nothing to that factor but it helps you focus and it does dial up your focus to like a medium low level that um is just smooth it's just smooth this is not a focused nootropic in the first place this is a fat burner this is to mobilize and burn fat and get you moving in the gym uh, this is going to last, like I said, the sweating effect at four pills between three and four hours. So if you're not moving after the gym, then I would start with maybe two pills. I think it even says on to start with two pills. We're just crazy enough, these are the reviewers here, uh, to do the four pills right off the bat. We just jump right into the max, I'm just the way we are. So I would start with two pills and um and work your way up if you need to because two pills may be enough and if you do if two pills are enough you're gonna get 60 servings out of this sucker so i don't know what the kick is with the 150 milligrams of caffeine but you know you can imagine the caffeine feel the energy feeling the, st the central nervous system kick that i had on this at four pills felt like 300 milligrams of caffeine i just had an underlying underlying um amount of endurance energy from the uh, thermogenic response in this on top of the caffeine it's just a different feel it's kind of a smooth feel so very good product i think this is great for beginners for advanced people beginners you want to start with one or two pills start with two pills you should be fine no craziness to this at all there's no alpha yo in it or anything like that uh advanced users you can start with four pills it's not crazy it's just you're gonna sweat so you gotta be prepared for the sweat some people like it some people don't 
like I said, I, I didn't like that I had to sit around sweating all day. I know I had it all day for two hours. So it's just kind of an uncomfortable feeling, get cold and stuff like that. So other than that, this is Dave. I'm going to be signing off. Get going. It's dinner time again. So I'll see you guys next time on the channel. I hope you enjoyed the review. If you did, give the video a thumbs up. And don't forget to subscribe to the channel. We'll see you next time.